How to draw a Vespa scooter step by step. Hey, learn how to draw hub crew. So for the first step of drawing our Vespa, we're going to begin by drawing a simple circle. Nice job. Now on the right side of the circle that we just drew, we're going to add in two C-like shapes, one on top of the other. This one will be our first. Nice. Now let's go ahead and make the second one. This one will be a little bit bigger than the one that we just made. Nice job. Now on the left and right hand side of what we just made, we're going to begin to add in shapes. These shapes will be rectangles. Now what we just drew aren't the handlebars just yet. Keep in mind, every Vespa scooter has a handlebar, so we're going to begin on the left hand side and make the first handle of our Vespa. On the right side, we will make the second handle of our Vespa. When we draw the handle, we're going to make a very thin rectangle shape going up and down, with one in the middle that will be long going from left to right, and then we will make a last one on the right side, which will be just as skinny as the first. Be sure to stick around to the very end so that we can call in our drawing together. Great job learning how to draw hub crew. Now underneath of the handle that we just drew, we're going to begin to add in a break. Now moving into the center of what we first drew, we're going to begin to make a total of three lines that will be all connected. The first two will be diagonal, and the last will be going from left to right, and it will be horizontal. And if I ever go too fast, feel free to pause the video. Now from this point, we are going to make our horizontal line going from left to right. Starting from the end point of which we just finished, we're going to make a backward C-like shape. Nice job! At the top of the curved line that we just drew, we're going to draw the seat of our Vespa. Inside of the seat, we're going to add in a line for detail. Now in order to draw the back end of our Vespa, we're going to make a curved L that will be backwards. This will help make the back end. A little to the left, we're going to make a line going from left to right which will connect to what we just made. Great job learning how to draw hub crew, so far this is coming along very well. We're not going to finish the back end just yet. Right now, we're going to go towards the front end of our Vespa and we're going to begin to make a long upside down U-like shape which will be curved. This will help make the middle piece of our Vespa. Right below, let's add in a long curved line. Very nice. Now from that upside down U that we just drew, we're going to make a small line which will connect it to that circle up above. Now the next part will be a little tricky, but be sure to follow along very carefully. We're going to go right below that U-like shape, and we're going to begin to make the front end of our Vespa, which will be right above the tire.
We will use a small line to connect the shape that we just made to the U-like shape right above, and then we will use a long curved line below to connect our Vespa to the other side. Fantastic! Now we're almost done, but we're not done just yet. Over to the left, we're going to begin to make the first tire of our Vespa. We're going to begin by making a big circle with a small circle in the center. Nice! Now moving to the right, we're going to draw the second tire of our Vespa. This will look very similar to the first. When making this tire, we're going to make a shape that will look similar to a C. Inside of this tire, let's add in a circle just how we did on the last. Great job! Now we're almost done, but we're not done just yet. We're going to go right above the tire, and we're going to begin to add in some detail. We're going to add in a curved line, along with a horizontal line that will be going from left to right. A little to the left, where we have that empty space which separates the back end of the Vespa to the front end, we're going to add in a line going from left to right, which will create the footrest. Now last but not least, on the very back of our Vespa, we're going to add in a square-like shape. This will be the light. This is how to draw a Vespa. Thanks for watching on how to draw hub. Be sure to stick around to the very end so that we can call on our drawing together. Also, if you enjoy watching step-by-step -step drawing tutorials, then I highly recommend that you consider hitting the subscribe button. Awesome. Well, I'll see you next time. Hey Learn How to Draw Hub crew, if you like videos like this one, then we highly recommend that you consider hitting the subscribe button so that we can keep you updated on videos like this every single day.